Hey, welcome to Geekamag and today we are going to talk about some ways you can optimize Windows 11 to get the best gaming performance. Now first of all, if you are facing worse gaming performance on Windows 11 when compared to Windows 10, this is probably because of two security features called Virtual Machine Platform and memory integrity that come enabled out of the box with the new OS. Here's how to disable them. First, go to the search icon and type turn Windows feature on or off. Open it and scroll down to find virtual machine platform. Uncheck this feature to disable it. Now restart the PC if required. Then go to search, type core isolation and click the top search result. In the settings page, Turn off memory integrity. If the UAC dialog box appears, click yes to continue. Now you will need to restart your system to apply the changes. Let's also make sure that we are running the latest GPU drivers. Keeping the graphics drivers up to date ensures that you get all the bug fixes, optimizations and performance improvements. To update your drivers, go to the official website of your GPU manufacturer and download the latest drivers for your specific GPU model. Install the drivers by following the on-screen commands. If you're using an NVIDIA GPU, then launch NVIDIA Control Panel and go to Manage 3D Settings. Then under Global Settings, find Power Management Mode and set it to Prefer Maximum Performance. Similarly, you can use GPU management tools from AMD and Intel. Before we go further, we are trying to hit 10k subscribers on YouTube. So please consider subscribing to the channel to help us continue making such content. Ok, getting back, make sure that Windows 11 game mode is enabled to get the most performance out of your system. For that, go to search, type turn on game mode, open it and toggle on the game mode. To provide the most power to your hardware, optimize your power settings. Go to Settings, System and find Power. Now change the power mode from Balanced to Best Performance. To further optimize things, adjust, minimize or disable visual effects in Windows 11. For that, go to Search, type Adjust Performance and click on the setting that says Adjust Appearance and Performance of Windows. Here under visual effects, select adjust for best performance or manually disable certain effects. But make sure smooth edges for screen fonts is enabled. Now click apply and ok to save the changes. You can also enable variable refresh rate to improve the visual fidelity as it syncs your monitor's refresh rate with the GPU's frame rate and reduces screen tearing and stuttering. But ensure that your monitor supports variable refresh rate and is connected to your GPU via DisplayPort or HDMI with FreeSync. Otherwise, you will not be able to find the option. Now to find it, go to Settings, System, Display, scroll down and click on Graphics. Now find the Advanced Graphics Settings section and here turn on the option for variable refresh rate. We recommend a restart after this. You should also disable apps that unnecessarily run in the background. To stop a particular app from running in the background, go to Settings, Apps, Installed Apps and then search for the one. Now click on the three dot menu on the right, look for Advanced Options and change the background usage to Never. Do this for all the apps that you think are problematic. Now also make sure that you are running the latest versions of DirectX and the .NET framework on your system. While these are usually delivered with Windows updates, you can manually download them from Microsoft's official website by searching for them. Enabling HDR or Auto HDR can significantly improve the visual quality of your game. To do that, go to the search icon, type HDR settings and open the top result. Now click on Use HDR and if Auto HDR is listed, enable that as well. If the HDR option is missing, then it's possible that your monitor does not support it. Turning on hardware accelerated GPU scheduling can boost the performance of the GPU by decreasing latency. If you own a PC whose GPU supports hardware acceleration coupled with graphics drivers with support for YDDM 2.7 or above, then you can enable this feature. Go to Settings, System, Display, 
graphics then default graphics settings and turn on hardware accelerated gpu scheduling while you are on this page also enable this handy feature named optimizations for windowed games if you play a lot of games in windowed mode this can be helpful make sure to restart your computer to apply the changes enhanced pointer precision or mouse acceleration can actually hurt your gaming abilities and negatively impact the experience so let's turn it off by going to the settings bluetooth and devices find the mouse section and scroll down to additional mouse settings under the pointer options disable enable pointer precision if you're unhappy with the new mouse speed you can adjust it through this slider now click on apply to save the changes running steam downloads and updates in the background can also affect your performance by a lot let's stop that by opening the steam client clicking on steam in the top left corner and then going to settings in the download tab look for schedule auto updates and select your desired time range for automatic updates now having a lot of unnecessary or non gaming startup apps can also consume a lot of resources to free up some go to settings apps startup apps and simply toggle off the ones that you think are non essential for gaming let's also make sure that you're using the primary and the best performing gpu for your games this is especially important for laptop users with both integrated and dedicated gpus go to settings system display scroll down to graphics then under custom options for apps click on browse now find the exe app for the preferred game in the installation folder click add now go to options and set the graphics preference to high performance with the dedicated gpu label save it and restart the pc to apply the changes You can also tweak the in-game graphics settings for the game that you're trying to optimize for. Lowering settings like anti-aliasing, shadow quality, texture quality and more can result in smoother gameplay. The new Windows 11 Record What Happened feature is handy but eats up a lot of resources. To disable it, go to Settings, Gaming, then Captures and toggle off the recording feature. If you're still running the traditional slow hard drives, it's worth considering SSDs for a big jump in loading times, texture rendering, and overall gaming performance. You can check out our article for the best NVMe M.2 SSDs linked in the description. To further optimize the system, monitor CPU and GPU temperatures using third-party tools and make sure the PC is well cleaned and has proper airflow to ensure optimal performance. You can also use third-party game boosting softwares like Razer Cortex, MSI Afterburner, and Gamefire. For more detailed information, check out our article on this topic that is linked in the description. If you found this video informative, hit the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you for watching.